morning to our DFS expert, JJ Zacharyson. Happy Friday, happy weekend. Let's get to you for your running backs. Here are your top three in the divisional round games this weekend. Yeah, my number three play this week, uh, it's sort of a combination of two guys because Mark Ingram's injury status is a little bit up in the air. But I do like Mark Ingram uh, against this Tennessee defense. Uh, they were 13th worst uh, against uh, fantasy running backs this season when adjusted for strength of opponent. The Ravens have the second highest implied team total on the slate. They're at home. They're big favorites. That's exactly what you want for fantasy running backs. So if Mark Ingram plays, I like him a lot. And if he doesn't play, Gus Edwards could go nuts, and he has a great value under that 6K mark. My number two value uh, running back this week, though, is Aaron Jones. He's at $8,200. You always run the risk with Aaron Jones that the Packers are going to use Jamal Williams a little bit more than we want them to use Jamal Williams. But Aaron Jones was sixth in the NFL this year in goal line rushes with 17. That helped him get 19 touchdowns overall this season. Uh, that number will regress a bit. We shouldn't expect him to keep that up. But Seattle's been a below average team against running backs this season, so he should be able to produce. But my number one play this week at running back, arguably my favorite play on this entire slate, is Damian Williams. He returned from injury in week 16, and in the final two weeks of the season, he was the Chiefs' number one guy. He averaged a running back rush share of 68%. He had a target share of 19% per game. Those are both elite numbers. We could see the Chiefs jump to a lead in this game, and if they do, they might go with a more run-heavy script, and that will help Damian Williams.